Hi Career Sighted, I'm Vivian Eisenstadt and I'm a physical therapist. We are the people that you go to when you have pain, whether it's neck pain, back pain, after an injury to rehabilitate. There's pediatric physical therapy for children. There's cardiac physical therapy to help somebody who had a heart attack. There's what I do, orthopedic physical therapy to help with sports injuries or postural syndromes. There's geriatric physical therapy. When a patient comes in, we give them a full evaluation and we look at the pain and how intense it is. And we evaluate the body movements, the range of motion, how the muscles feel, if they're tender to touch, how somebody walks, how they stand, how they sit. It's a tiring physical job because you're literally lifting people's bodies and doing deep tissue work. The most challenging part is the conversation of insurance companies wondering whether what we're doing is valid. I enjoy completely healing people. At the end of a first session when somebody turns to me and says, I finally have hope again to get out of pain. That's a brilliant moment for me. An ideal scenario, someone's in and out of here within a month. If you're looking to be a physical therapist, you have to want to relate to people. You have to really want to be in the medical part of it and understand the human body. I was playing sports and then I went to college and didn't know what I was going to do because all I wanted to do was play sports. I had a personal training degree before I became a physical therapist, so it was an organic shift to switch from one to the other. When you go to college, you go into the administration office and you find out what prerequisites you need to take for physical therapy school. Usually it's a year of chemistry, a year of biology, a year of psychology, a year of physics, anatomy, physiology, and then you also go right to volunteer in a physical therapy facility so that you can get your volunteer hours down. In order to become a physical therapist, when I went to school, they only had master's degrees. Now they have PhDs. Some programs are combining their undergraduate and graduate programs. The education that I had in school was only half of the education. The other education is practicing. Every facility has its own way of doing things. You learn a lot when you work in hospital settings where there's a lot of other physical therapists around you. If you're looking for a profession that really leaves you fulfilled and peaceful at the end of the day because you know that you touched someone's life and you know that you made a difference for them, physical therapy is a great way to do that. Thank you, Career Sighted.